Greetings and welcome back to Monster Legends. Okay, so some things have happened in the meantime. The big thing, of course, that happened in the meantime was this. The limited path for Dunra opened up, and as you can see, I have her sitting in my hatchery right now. Um, it, it opened up yesterday morning, and I was fortunate enough to catch the first hour because there was a 20% reduction, so I was able to get her in the remaining seven minutes because I just kind of like connected so it was open and so I had seven minutes left so I had to work fast. Uh, I did it with 49 coins to spare. A lot of that had to do with an anonymous uh, contribution by somebody in the team that gave me an extra 500 coins. Uh, so that was, of course, extremely appreciated. Uh, if you don't have her, then uh, there's not going to be any more discounts at the time I'm recording because there was another one this morning. It was only 10%, and I've never seen them do, do two discounts in a day. So you're just going to have to have the coins. And by having the coins, about 5,000. So, I mean, the rewards were very good. There was a 5-speed... And I think there was a six damage in addition to gems and stuff. The limited path always has good stuff in it. So it's another reason you want to do it if at all possible. But unfortunately, there is less than a day left. And if you don't have the coins, well, you have to make a decision whether you're going to do that or you're going to go for something else in the maze. Yeah, in the... Um, when I caught it this morning, I did spend some. So I think I moved Salamander a bit here. Hold on a second. I moved this one, too, just because I had some things there. But I moved Salamander all the way down here. Since I did have a discount, so I figured, you know, I'm not going to get many discounts. So I moved him down there a little bit, too. Wouldn't mind getting a rank up on that one. Besides, there are some rewards in there as well. Anyway, um, hopefully you have enough coins. I know it's very difficult. Did say that in the beginning when the uh, May started. It says it's probably going to be early. It's probably going to be expensive. So, hopefully, hopefully everybody is um, able to get it. And to those who don't, there's still some good things in the maze. I mean, there's an Agursus in there who's not too deep. You know, I basically just made it so I can't do that because I did spend a lot of uh, coins doing this. But, uh, you know, there's opportunities for some things in this maze. So, and we still do have a bit uh, until it's done. And as I understand it, there's going to be a race uh, right after this. So, but this, this event isn't over yet. All right, there was something else that I saw that popped up new this morning. Let's take a quick look at that. Okay, so there's a breeding event in order to maybe get uh, uh, Kihaku and maybe some extra cells as well. So you can see you need a Cryotin and a Vagmagma, and uh, you might get yourself a Kihaku. If you do this breeding, apparently you get an extra 20 cells, which is kind of useful if you have just one. That way you can get the 100 from taking it apart and an extra 20 so you don't have to use any elementium or any uh, ice cells or anything like that. No, water. Water ones. So, and of course, apparently uh, there's a, the Joker situation here going. I'll probably take a shot at that. It does have a day and, you know, 18 hours left on it. I'll probably take an, I don't want to do too much to my, uh, my hatchery though. So, that's a thing. Uh, the other thing they have going right now is that we, in Monsterwood, they're giving the new relic chests away, and you can actually get some really good luck with that. We can get some good luck. So let's just, I, I, did, I, I watched a whole bunch of videos just beforehand. First of all, you'll notice it's different from the regular relic reward. So I only got one silver chest, but that one silver chest actually gave me a, a gold relic. So, and I have gotten silvers from these, so I'm just going to open them up. I'm going to open them all up and see if I get some more silvers. Okay, yeah, I got... Oh, wait a minute. No, I, I don't think this time I didn't get any silvers this time. Oh, there's one. There's one. There's one right there. Right, there's one right there. So, apparently you can get a diamond. I'm guessing you'd probably have to get a gold chest for that, and then you'd have to be lucky. So, as I said, I got one silver... And the one silver did have a gold in it. So, I mean, it's definitely worth it if you want to, if you have the time and you can do that and you're not having any technical problems. Uh, I have had a few technical problems with it where something would come up and say, please rotate your device. And it just kind of ignores my attempts to rotate my device. So, uh, another thing is that you can see bouncing on the top is that I have bow breath there. I'm going to do a video for that later to give you a little preview. Lots of open ruin slots, which is very, very useful. Very useful. Can't wait to feed that one up. I hear it's very supporty, very fast, 
and has a lot of extra turning going on there. So just keep it away from uh, the Maquis, right? Anyway, I think that's about it. So yeah, war is actually going to be over in a little while here, eh, two hours or something like that. So I'm sneaking this in after coming back from uh, a trip a couple of states away. So let's see. I, I, yeah, we won the last one. We're not going to win this one. And they've actually been rather complete there in our um, const destruction. So I, I don't think we're going to do it, but we'll see if we can get some uh, fights going in. I think I saw a couple here that I might be able to do something with. Uh, this one, I think I can probably take a shot at it. You know, anything can happen. Um, actually, you'll notice there were a lot of little open spots there. The reason for that is the first time I tried to do stuff, I had some here. Let's just go back for a moment. Yeah, resists. You know, I, I tried to do that first one, that 25, is that my denial got completely resisted. And, of course, the Prince Charmless just tore us apart. So, yeah, all it takes is one resist, right? Hopefully we don't get any. Anyway, I have Big Al in there, and uh, I got some big firepower in the back here. So I'm hoping I can at least come up with three coins for this one. All right, let's go. Because right, Big Al has got an unpaid loan that he wants returned here. Okay, he did not have his zero cooldown, I kill you all, which is a very good thing. Uh, you did not get the guard down. That's unfortunate. All right, let's see. Um, uh, let's get rid of him first. Okay, and luckily I don't see any very bad relics taking my stamina away. Okay, he's dead. All right, who wants this? We'll start with you. Okay, a little bit extra armor, but we're going to get you weak. Oh, I love that guard down. It's so useful. Okay, unfortunately, he's got a lot of health, but fortune... Actually, I should be working on uh, Q, uh, Neobuki. The reason for that is because Zyla is Thunder. It doesn't make a difference for him, but it does make a difference for her. All right, hold on a second. Okay, I might be able to come back to him here anyway. Okay, and she's going to be finishing him off, I think. And he's out. All right. Oh, and by the way, I have hatched that uh, extra one I had of her, and it's currently being extracted. So she's going to be ranking up fairly soon. And why wouldn't I want to do that? All right, so there's my three. I don't know if I'm going to get the next three. Uh, because like I said, I had a bit of a resistance problem the last time. All right, let's look around here. Yeah, anything that's got a 15 at this point, I probably want to avoid. Yeah, that looks like a good idea. Yeah, that looks like a good idea. Um, that doesn't... Yeah, that, that could be very... Wow, that's... I wish I could throw an anticipation team in for that. Actually, I could put Dave in. thing is, I couldn't put anybody else in, you know? I mean, that right there... I really wish I could put a, a team together to put Ragnarok in, uh, Marquis de Flamme, and um, I forget his name at the moment. Stingray. You know, the, the Stingclaw. Stingclaw. Um, that would be great right there. I mean, I think they'd probably win anyway, but uh, that would be interesting. All right, let's look around. Because at this point, we've lost. I'm just going to try to get whatever I can. That looks like it's too much speed. Because uh, that's what I'm looking for at the moment. I'm looking for an opportunity to get in here. Here, let's move up this way here. Because uh, Big Al in this combo is... Although I, I do have a little bit more speed because I can use my patient cyber. You know, the problem is if I put him in, he's taking up the spot that I would be saving for Dave, you know. Ugh. No, that's no good. 15s. Okay, what do we have here? That speed-wise, I think that would work. It's just they're going to be really hard to kill. All right, let's just uh, see what we can do here. Yeah, the thing is, I can't use Dave, or, or I can't use Dave or Sparta if I do that. Although maybe since these individuals are here, let's throw him in for a minute. See, this is what I did the last time. I tried Bagel, but the problem is I can't freeze anybody because there's at least one mountain in there, right? So let me see. Do I have any opportunity? Stunning? That's not going to work either. Yeah, I mean, I have to use Patient Cyber. I don't, I don't see any other way. So 
I guess I'm going to use O'Reilly here. And yeah, stunning isn't going to work. All right, now I'm going to use Zap, obviously. Right, so I can't use Sparta and I can't use Dave because I'm going to need to use him. All right, because he's in terms of, I, I, I have to do cooldowns here. If I don't do cooldowns, it's just going to be a huge problem because, yeah, I can't stun or freeze him. She's, is she tough? She's tough. I think he's tough as well. Yeah, I mean, they can't get away from the cooldown refreshes, but, you know, everything else is going to be a problem. All right, let's go. Who's going first? Oh, I was kind of hoping the uh, Leprechaun would be going before Zap. Yeah, Zap has a missing problem, and I would really like to have done something about it. Okay, so let's see. Activate cooldowns. And nobody got the... Okay, there were no effects. Okay, don't, don't kill the Leprechaun. It's just bad. All right, well, we can get rid of you, hopefully. Because you're water. They all have six figures in, uh, in terms of health, too. So, like I said, very hard to kill. Luckily, the uh, Leprechaun has lots of dots. Okay, if we could just get rid of one of them, it would be great. Okay, don't do that. He's got, like, nothing left. You know, that's kind of, I might as well just charge. I'm going to leave that up to the Leprechaun. All right. Uh, a night of fun for everybody. Okay, that's going to kill the Cryotin. Okay, I, I think I can pretty much ignore the Cryotin at this point. Um, who do I really not wanting to be able to do something? Um, I'm going to reset your cooldowns down here again because I really don't want you to get the opportunity to do anything. What did you just do? Okay, he's dead. What did you do? Oh, you just, um, you gave yourself regeneration. That's extremely unfortunate. And you're weak to his damage. All right, well, I have to go for this guy. Okay, did you miss him or it was just little to no damage? Okay. And you're out again. And that's not going to do anything, so we're just going to charge. All right, um, let's just try that for some more dots. Okay, you're nearly dead. Fun dungeons. Remove positive status effects. Don't mess with the leprechaun, they're dangerous. Okay, you are not able to put that on yourself because you have that. Isn't that just fun? All right, how long until you get... You get Pathogen back next round. All right, so I'm going to charge. Yeah, unfortunately, you are weak. You're not weak to electricity, so I'm just going to do this. And hopefully the Leprechaun can mess with you, because he's got some blindness for you. Okay, charge. Yeah, Zyla with that... Um, the banner is just so useful. She's just got so much um, stamina, and she does more damage. I don't know. He's, he's really fallen back now. Once Xyla gets that rank up, she's just going to completely overwhelm him. All right, let's see. Uh, total damage reduction and some of that. Okay, hopefully those dots... Yeah, the dots kill him. Okay, so that time, everything worked out. Um, yeah, we're going to lose. We're going to lose. Hopefully, we will get uh, somebody in a little bit better position for us, you know, not quite as powerful in the next war, which you can see is like an hour and 46 minutes from now. Okay, so why don't we do some PvP? All right, so I got some teams, grabbed them when I came back in this morning. And yes, I do have them in, but, you know, the reason for that is because I was also doing attacks of my own, which is the reason you're going to see the team is in, right? Because I was trying to get as many coins as I could. You know, every once in a while, you can get those 15 coins from a PvP win. So as a result, I also have these guys in so that I wasn't going to be putting too much space in there. So I think we can get some good teams here. All right, so why don't we begin? By the way, there is going to be one individual repeat. 
Um, I wanted to do something with the last uh, battle today, and I forgot to check, so I have a repeat character. And the repeat, repeat character is actually going to be in the first team. All right, so let's begin. Our first team today was suggested by Dragon Plays Gamer French. And the first member of this team is actually Dave, which is great because I don't have to go looking for Dave and do a little strategic cut on that one. So Dave's up first. All right, the next member of this team is somebody else I'd really like to get an upgrade on uh, is uh, Taylor. I'm thinking she'd be a lot more powerful if I could rank her up. She's already powerful. And the third member of this team is going to be in the light. And this is going to be someone I'd really like to get a rank up on. But that's probably never going to happen. Just saying. Because that is Elvira. All right. So obviously, I guess we're just, basically we're just looking for a team that we can beat after the fact, which shouldn't be a problem. We have a lot of firepower there. It's just as we want them all going before um, we want them all going before uh, we go, right? Because we want to evade, right? All right. Uh, yeah, but the problem with that, of course, is. Um, uh, Corral Brutalis would be very counterproductive because I don't want that doing the mega taunt, right? Um, what would happen up the middle? I mean, the Voltic's probably... It really depends on speed, doesn't it? All right, let's just see how this works out. It's probably a mistake, but let's see. Oh, wow, they have like... Actually, the Voltic is going first, isn't he? I mean, he's the fast one here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so he's going first. What about you guys? No, no. All right, so the Voltic and then we go. So I'm guessing he's going to charge because we're all going to be evading. Oh, did you give us extra stamina? Okay, so we are all going now. All right, so let's see. I, I would like him to get rid... That's a good question. I have to get rid of the uh, the Voltec. I really do. All right. All right, and then I'm going to do a death door on him. Good question. Good question. Um, it will kill the Voltec, and I don't have to worry about it. So, isn't that funny? The only one who actually got the sunburn was the Voltec, right? All right, and let's just do a little bit of this. All right, now we're going to take some hits. Or not. Okay, you stunned two individuals that I did not want stunned. All right, let's think. Uh, what about a single target one? That would probably kill him down here because he's going to have shocked. He's going to have another round of shock. Unless you miss. Oh, you just, oh, that's not good. All right, that's 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 not good at all. All right, um, you know I really do need to get rid of him down here. Okay, and do I? Yeah, I I, I kind of need to do this. Okay, I hold it, hit him, and get because I wanted Elvira to get the uh, possession off. All right, think. All right, um, that'll hurt him. But I really do need to get rid of this guy down here. Will that do it? All right. Oh, what? <sighs> Did you really just miss both of them? Really? All right. Thank you. Okay, boom on the head. I, I'm pretty sure you're dead at this point, but... Oh, Vyra, you really let me down there. I had just removed negative status effects from you, and you missed both of them? Oh, that's just, that's just not right at all. Not right at all. And Ruin, we're, we're, gonna, we're getting along now. It's really good that we're getting along now. Makes everybody happy. Okay, so let's go in and kick up team number two. Team number two was suggested by Yogesh. I think that's it, isn't it? Yogesh? All right. And Yogesh wanted to see, and we're going to start with uh, a big guy here, 
who gives us lots of opportunities. A lot of 110s now, isn't there? By the way, there is a new 110. Did I pass him? Yeah, there he is. Thomas is now a 110. And I took the support um, damage off of him and gave him a 6. So he's going to hit really hard now. So uh, you might see him getting used more often. Anyway, we're starting with Nova. Uh, next up, we're starting, then we're going over to Zap. And then for a little, hold a second here, over to metal. For a little musical accompaniment, we're going with Gene. All right, so obviously we have a rather strong situation going here. So is it strong enough to risk the one on the right? I don't know about that. I'm gambling as to how much um, speed that that sun blast is going to have. He's got five levels on me, but does he have a 10? That's a gamble. Do I want to take that gamble? I mean, I have Zap. Is he going to... Uh... You know what the problem with that one is? I have to kill the... Um... The Prince Charm, actually all of them are dangerous. And I honestly, if I had another major damage dealer, I would consider it. It's just the thing is, the big thing that Gene's going to give me is two things. Gene's going to give me a group stun and a single target possession. The single target possession is more, is more or less useless against the Prince Charmless and is completely useless against the Undertaker. Yeah, I, I just don't think that one would go well. Let's try it anyway, because I'm crazy. If he's got, like, a huge... Okay. We're in a lot of trouble because they're going to be hard to kill. That Undertaker... I don't know why you'd put the damage on him. If you put, like, full health on him... Okay. Well, if that Prince Charmless ends up moving, we are so dead. He's just going to kill us all. Okay, so obviously I'm going to um, activate their cooldowns. Yeah, yeah, you have so got to kill this guy in the front. Oh, that's ugly. What do you have? Oh, wow. That's just... What am I going to do here? What am I going to do? All right, you know... Um, what do you have? Maximum life. After being hit is removed from a random enemy. All right, you know what? I probably need to go after him. Oh, this is... See, if I hit him one more time, I got to do it. Yeah, I, I can't do anything now. Okay. Um... Oh, he's dead. Okay, that's one problem solved. Okay, I... Do they both have guard down? Good. Then he should be able to get the stuns down. So kill them all. Good, 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 good. Guard down is very useful that way. All right, I am going to... I might as well just do this. I, sh I might want to hold on to it. You know what? I'm going to hit the guy down below just to do damage and take a little bit more of his stamina away because it's useless against him anyway. All right, um... Good question. All right, let's get rid of him. I don't want any resurrections. No resurrections allowed. Or in the words of Thanos, no resurrections this time. Okay, good. He's dead. All right, and you can't do anything at the moment. But you can. All right, and boom. Yeah, you know, it all comes down to speed, doesn't it? Whoever goes first... If he's got it to back it up, wins. All right, and and a spin. Okie dokie. Cells is good. I'll take cells. I'll take cells. All right, so let's go with team number three. Team number three today was suggested by Pineapple Joel. And Pineapple Joel... It doesn't seem to like speed. All right, let's see what we got here, though. We might get lucky. We might get lucky. All right, we're going to start over in fire. And this is going to be... Where is he? Uh, Mordred. Uh, next up, we have in light. 
Where is Fortune? And finally, we're going over to Fire again. And this is going to be Elisha. All right, so yeah, we kind of have a speed issue here. So maybe we can get lucky. All right, looking around. I'm not seeing a lot of luck at the moment. So I'm going to do a refresh. Okay, well, we do have a little bit of a uh, denial missing thing on the left, which might be our opportunity. Although, is, is playing with Zyla really something we want to do, right? I don't... Oh, up the middle. Well, I guess that really depends, doesn't it? Who do I want to play with anyway, right? I think it's safer to go up the middle. Another reason is because the Baroness can really just be a pain. All right, but uh, I do have a general here who's kind of annoying and can do complete heals. All right, it looks like who's going first? 449. Yeah, I'm guessing that you're going first. Yeah, okay, so we're just going to have to try to endure until we can get some stuff going here, right? Oh, that's very inconvenient. All right, very inconvenient. All right, well, let's get some uh, Ignite going here. I would like it if she went first, but she didn't, so there's not a lot I can do about it. Oh, that's annoying. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, he knew his enemy. Okay, and I do believe, well, two of them will be dead, but I do believe the Agursus is going to live longer than me. Yep, thought so. Yep, speed! Speed is a, grand, a great thing. It's a wonderful thing. It's a grand thing, you know? Uh, now, it could very well be a situation where your own Metalisha actually has a lot of speed, but remember, it's mine that's going to be playing. Just try to keep that in mind. Okay, so... Let's go with our fourth and final team for today. And this is the one that's going to have a little bit of a repeat. Anyway, our fourth and final team today is from... Subscribe to PewDiePie! Yeah, as if he needs my help to say that, right? I sh he should be saying subscribe to uh, a game hopping, right? Anyway, subscribe to PewDiePie wanted to see... We're starting in light, and this, of course, is the repeat, because this is going to be... Where is Elvira? Uh, next up, we're going with over in fire. This is going to be Pepe. Actually, I did. I sh I opened up that slot. I forgot to put something there. So, and we are also going to be going over to fire. And this is going to be Kane. All right. I am doing this team, of course, because this is subscribed to PewDiePie's birthday. Apparently, subscribe to PewDiePie is 17 today. All right. Congratulations and happy birthday. All right. So let's see what we got here. Obviously, um, I'm, I don't know. It's Pepe and Braum are probably going to be faster because they're a higher level. So we'll have to see what goes on. So I, it would be better if all of the other team went first, right? So we could try to team on the left and see how that works out. I'm hoping that they do go first, that being the Dungeon Master and the uh, the Thetis. So we'll see how this works out. If they go first, they should just charge. Looks like they're all going first. All right, I'm curious. Okay, so they're both under 4,000. Oh, wow, they are all going to be going first, which is wonderful because Elvira is going to give us evade. So they, uh, does any of them, I don't think Dungeon Master can take away positive status effects. And he's a damage dealer, so he doesn't have that. All right, but they should charge. Okay, she buffed. Okay, he did that. Okay, well, that's kind of annoying. Uh, but you know what? Uh, that shouldn't be a problem. All right, so we're going to do all against one, and that's going to give them sunburn and burning. Okay, and you're up now. All right, let's see for a minute. Uh, well, obviously, I have to take this guy. I don't have much of a choice in the matter. 
And then this one. Who's going next? I think Elvira can kill the dungeon. Oh, actually, probably just kill both of them. Yeah, Elvira didn't have to do anything. Well, actually, she, she did her job already with the evade, didn't she? All right. Okay, unfortunately, we did lose one today. So, it was close, though. It came down to two. I'm going to let that slide. It's only once in a while. That's fine. Got some runes today, so that's all right. All right, and I see somebody's got Dunron, and I won't be having my Dunron in a while. Right, because there's my Dunron right there. All right, I'm going to be doing a feeding probably later on Balbreath, although I, my video might be out tomorrow. I'm getting a late start here, so that video might be out tomorrow. That way we can have Monster Legends as many different days as we can. But I'll probably do that just because I don't want to accidentally sell it. You know, that happened to me once. I don't think it was anything significant. At least maybe I'm just blotting it out because it was a terrible memory if it did happen. It might have. It might have. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for today. So, like I said, uh, you have the uh, limited path in there right now of Dunra. It's got less than a day left. Hopefully, you have enough coins. There's not going to be any more discounts today. Like I said, there was one this morning. It was a 10%. Um, so, if you don't have the coins, you'll have to make a decision whether or not you want the uh, rewards that are in there. Like I said, there was a 5 speed. There was a 6 damage. There was some gems and stuff like that. But uh, you'll have to make the decision for yourself what you want to do. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See you.